So there are a couple ways to block unknown devices or pause internet service on known devices on your Starlink network. And in this tutorial, we're gonna be showing you how to do both methods. Let's jump right into it. So the first method involves pausing internet service on devices that are known to your network. And what I mean by that is, let's say you have this, something like this, an iPad or something, and you wanna temporarily disable internet access to that device. Well, the Starlink router has a setting that allows you to pause internet service temporarily to that device. So here's how you do it. Okay, so to pause internet service on a device on your Starlink router, what you need to do is open up the Starlink app. And then if you scroll down a little bit, you'll notice under network, you have a device count there. In my case, I have two devices connected. So if you click on network, you'll see a list of the devices. And as you can see here, I've got this iPhone, which is current device that I'm on, and then also an unnamed device. So I don't know what that device is. So let's say I want to pause the internet service for it. So if I tap on it, I get more information, shows me the Mac address, the IP address, all that sort of stuff. And what you can do is you see that pause button there. If you hit this, you can pause internet service temporarily for this device. So if I hit pause, You'll notice now I have the message internet access for this device is currently paused. If I go back to this device screen on the Starlink app, you can see a tag there as well, showing you that that device is now paused. That device is not disconnected from the Wi-Fi network. It's just paused as far as internet access goes. Now to unpause it, you go back in and you can click unpause and you confirm. And now that device should have internet access restored. So a couple of caveats to the pause method through the Starlink app. It doesn't actually disconnect the device from your Wi-Fi network. The device will stay connected. It just won't have internet access. The other thing is it's pretty easy to get around this pause method. So a lot of devices have a Mac address that could be spoofed or changed uh, either through an app or sometimes those devices have anti-tracking methods or privacy things that will do that for them. So it's pretty easy to actually get around the pause method. So it's not really a great long-term solution or it's not a great method for devices that you really don't know what they are on your network. For that, I recommend doing a couple of, of things. You can either do a factory reset on your Starlink router. There's a button for that in the back here. Or you could just change the Wi-Fi name and password to something more secure. When you do either of those things, changing the password on your network or doing a factory reset and starting over, that will kick all the devices off of your network, including the unknown ones and the known devices, and they'll have to reestablish a connection by entering in the new password and the new network name. So that right there is the best and most secure way of kicking unknown devices off your network or disabling internet access and connectivity for devices permanently until they re-enter that password. And like I said, the pause method is really only good for, you know, if you have known devices that you'd like to temporarily disable, that's when you would use that one. So I hope this helped answer your question about removing unknown devices from your network or blocking internet access for some devices. Let me know if you have any questions or feedback in the comments below, and I'll see you in the next video.